and today I'm going to show you how we can use the announcements app on Office 365 or the reminders app as I've called it. Now again if you've seen any of my other tutorials you'll know that I call apps a friendly name in an Office 365 education environment. It just makes it more user friendly for my students. So if you're adding the app you're looking for announcements but you can call it whatever you want. So I've called it reminders and I'm going to click on reminders to take me into the app. Once I'm in the app it's nice and simple to add a reminder. I just click on new announcements and this is going to allow me to make an announcement of whatever I want. Now I use this quite a lot to remind my students, especially in my form, of things that are coming up. So for example the title might be Remember Mufti Day and in the body I'm going to remind them that Mufti Day is tomorrow and I'm going to say it expires therefore tomorrow which is when Mufti Day expires. Now I might give this uh, notice well in advance and I might say remember Mufti Day is on the date. I can do it however I want but as soon as I hit save it does two things. It adds the reminder to my list of reminders. Also because on my home page I've added announcements or reminders as a web part you'll see when I go to my home page now that that reminder is now right at the top of my site. So remember Mufti Day is there right at the top. I find it really helps. Um, so far, I've never had a student in my form forget a non-uniform day, so something must be working. And that is how we use the Reminders or Announcements app in Office 365.